Hey everybody, Lancer here. Welcome you back to more Heartbound. This is actually um, the uh, beta that was released, I think, pretty recently. Um, I figured I would kind of start start this like pr pretty much about where the uh, the first demo left off. Apparently, there's there's some more content to it. As far as like. Uh, a anything that was changed um everything pretty much seems to be the same although now in this version you can collect socks there's like socks like outside the house inside the house in different rooms and you know lore will make a little comment about it and you'll kind of collect it i don't know if that does anything but um i don't know but it's fun i guess you know why not silliness and such so let's go so when you came up here like the like, this is pretty much where the uh, first demo would just end. But apparently it continues. So... Let's just keep this going. Whoa. What do we got here? Whoa. Hmm. Do you have to... Can you, like, push this? Ah, yes. Log pushing puzzles. Makes me think of Golden Sun. So that's cool. What was that? Okay. Not exactly complicated. So this is this a note? We can fix this. Okay. I don't know why I pushed that all the way down. <laughs> Pretty sure you don't need to do that, but... What do we got here? Oh my gosh! What? what? It's just a nightmare. This isn't real. It's it's shouting obscenities to me in some weird language. I don't like it. Leave me alone. I don't know what you're saying, man. You aren't real. Baron is fine. It's just a dream. Wake up, wake up, wake up. Uh-oh. What is this, the battle? What am I supposed to do? There's an axe. Okay. Interesting. Am I supposed to be pushing that button or oh you can move, okay. I guess I guess that's how you avoid attacks. Is that damaging it? I'm not really sure. Where is he? Okay. I I kind of get it. Is this actually damaging him though? I'm not really sure. Oh yeah, it is. Oh, he shot from both of them. I'm doing some damage. Give him back! That is quite an okay. The battle system was kind of reminding me of, like, Undertale. That is quite enough, whoever this guy is. He looks fancy. So I think that was more of, like, a tutorial to the battle system. I don't know who this dude is. Don't give up. You can beat this. Time to wake up. I don't want to wake up, man. I got stuff to do. Where am I? Where'd you end up, Lore? Home at last. <laughs> Who's this guy? Where am I? What is this? Where is Baron? You're safe and in my library. Enlighten me on what a Baron is. My dog. 
He's more than that. Baron is my best friend. Aww. I see. I'm sorry to say things are a bit more complicated than you would like. What do you mean? Where is he? In a place beyond this world. I can help, but it will not be easy for either of you. Just tell me where he is. Please, calm yourself. I am not your enemy. I... I'm sorry. None of this makes any sense. I didn't mean to snap at you. That's quite alright, Lore. Life doesn't always make sense. We make do with what we have. What? How do you know my name? I'll tell you when you're older. As for me, you may call me Binder. Okay. <laughs> what? Your name is Binder? Feel free to look around. I will be setting the time. Setting the time? Well, there are a lot of clocks on the wall. I guess we can look around. Opening the chest reveals an apple? Hey, that's private. The apple's private? Okay, then. There's a terrarium with a large stick placed in the center. I see you found Agnes. Her bark is worse than her bite, I can assure you. Cool. We got books. A guardian may only change events on a given page if the presence of an anomaly is detected. Without such an anomaly, the guardian passes through a page unnoticed and invisible to inhabitants. Living as ghosts, the guardians wait and watch over the pages of creation. Alright. At the spine of the world, a guardian perceives every page simultaneously. Guardians can move freely between these pages to record any and all events. The flood of information brought on by the power of the spine can be overwhelming. Hmm. Anomalies can manifest in many different forms at any given place or time within a page. As the anomaly progresses, aspects of the page may become corrupted. The results of this corruption are highly unstable and impact each host differently. Darksiders are born from anomalies in the early stages of corruption. These creatures are... Excuse me. These creatures are twisted manifestations of the original inhabitants of the page. The host's mind and features are altered drastically as the corruption takes hold. Hmm. Papers and a strange runic text litter the table. Oh boy. Is that the language that creature was speaking? Maybe. Maybe not. A small pile of books. Nice. A pile of books. Not a small pile, but a pile. The leather-bound tome shifts away when you reach for it. Don't worry, it's just shy around new people. <laughs> a medium pile of books. A strange research paper. How to prepare a dwarf in a jar. Excuse me? It's thriving despite the humble arrangement. Well, that's something, I suppose. A large pile of books. The twin terrariums each have a stick placed in the center. What's with the stick? Yeah, okay. The dull red book lets out a belch when you try to open it. Careful with that. There are only a few known to exist. Alright. You find a creeping sock. It's crawling across the room. Grandfather Book Tower guards his family from the north. I see you've met the Book Towers. Can you believe they all came from the same family tree? Apparently so. Okay, is that an apple? A shiny crisp apple sits on the shelf. It seems stuck in place by some unknown force. <laughs> this entire bookcase was carved out of a single block of wood. You can't even read the books. Aww. I want to get my literature on. A gnarled black root lays in a terrarium on the shelf. The label says, Break glass in case of goblins. Thankfully, there don't seem to be any rabbits nearby. <laughs> a small dog figurine sits solemnly in a glass display nestled between the books. Staring at the figurine, you are overcome with a sudden and intense loneliness. Hey, Binder. You may take him with you as long as you show him the respect he deserves. With Binder's blessing, you pocket the tiny dog figurine. Sweet. Not the curious type? That's quite alright. The clock is ready for you. Unfortunately, you must handle this trial alone. What trial? 
Trial? Clock? What are you talking about? In order to save Baron, you will need to go somewhere I cannot. There is an artifact of great power trapped between worlds. This clock will take you to it. Can it really bring Baron back? I hope so. It's the best chance we have. I understand. Stand back. I will open the way through. The connection is established. Please step inside. So we're going inside time, apparently. Hey, Binder. Yes, Lore. Thanks. Think nothing of it. You would do the same for me. Would I? Hope this works. We're inside a clock. It's like being in an elevator or something. Like a teleporter. Oh, boy. This place is falling apart. I hope Binder was right. What is this place? You can push this, apparently. I don't know what that does, but you can push that. What is this? They're like pointing in different directions. I don't know if that means anything. Push this down, I suppose. Again, I don't know if that's doing anything, but... Oh, okay. That did something. Ah, it's a puzzle! We figured it out! Great job getting through that. Let me know if you need help. Yeah, let me just ask for help from a disembodied voice. Quality plan. I heard that. Ugh. <laughs> Alright. Let me get a sip of my tea real quick. Okay. Let's see, what do we got here? I think, yeah, those are from the other room. It's like we gotta do something here. Oh, that changes, like, the... The shape. I imagine that'll come into play somehow. Okay. Hmm. Got it. Pretty simple stuff, really. It's not too hard to figure out. This is the final challenge. The next room holds the artifact. Alright. I'll try not to get lasered in space and stuff. Quality plan. I mean, it does look like we're in space, doesn't it? I can't push that while it's kind of beamed like that. Well, I hope that needs to be over there, because I don't think you, you can bring it back. Can you? I don't think so. Whoa. Hmm. Can we even get to that other one? Unless you can... Okay. I was gonna say. Yeah, I think you need to turn that off so you can push this. Over here? Okay. And then turn it back on. Fancy. Got it. I think that was easier than the second one, really. So where's this artifact we're supposed to be getting? You're almost there. The artifact is just up ahead. Be careful, Lore. I'll be careful. It's a book! Wait. Something's wrong. Binder, what's going on? I understand now. Lore, get out of there! It's a trap! I'm scared. Make it stop! We need this to save him! What the hell's going on? I don't know. It's freaking me out, man. Looks like Lore's being possessed or something. Oh my gosh. What just happened? Did we die? Is the game over? What happened? Don't worry. You'll get your chance. Oh, that's good. It's good to have a chance, at least. Until then, you can follow us at... <laughs> that's not the end of it, is it? I think it is.
Is that it? That it? Apparently that's it. Okay. Well, that was fun. Uh, so, so at least we kind of got to see a glimpse of the battle system, although it was extremely brief. And yeah, it kind of reminded me of uh, Undertale a little bit. So that's kind of interesting. And we got to meet some dude named Binder. I don't know who the hell he is, but we ended up transported into some kind of uh, thing. Some other place, and then we got some artifact. And, uh, yeah. <laughs> and then something happened. I don't even know what happened, but something happened, so I guess we'll have to wait to find out what happens next. But, yeah, I... I I'm really enjoying this game, you know? It's good stuff. You know, I like the the art direction and just the whole general, like, the, the like the humor of the dialogue and stuff. You know, I like it. It's good stuff. Definitely looking forward to seeing more of it. So, hope you guys enjoyed this uh, beta demo thingamajigger, and uh, hopefully we'll see more in the future. So, thanks for watching, guys. Good stuff.